So for posterity and insurance, we'll take some pictures of what happened here. This was the wall. There was water up till there, you can see. It's probably water, I don't know if you can see on this side. That, when the, this broke, which I was outside for, came down here, flooded the pool, then came down the step. Rigel and I were outside when this whole thing happened, and I was able to grab Rigel, stand up on this, and get the door shut. That's how high the water level was, and yet none of the glass broke. So water everywhere. Water started rushing around both sides of the house. The problem is there's nowhere for the water to breach on this side, so it pooled. You can see all of this was nice, neat rocks. Now it's all destructed. The whole pool filter is destroyed. The air conditioners are destroyed. The water heater is destroyed. Um, so, yeah. Well, here's hoses and sprinklers and stuff that are destroyed. Um, all of the potted plants back here are destroyed. The pool is destroyed. You can see water all over the place. All the furniture got washed up to here. All right. Just destruction everywhere. Potted plants were washed totally down the street. The sunroom did not truly breach, but there was water in it. And you can still see there is still water in it. The whole thing is wrecked in there. And now we'll go into the house where the guys from Serve Pro started working. You know, all the drains in here are going to be shot. So they've had to rip out the carpet. They're going to have to rip out all drywall up to two feet in every room. Check for water damage in the frame. So, kitchen, not too much damage. But it's still definitely, I don't know if you can see that, because there's no power. Just mud everywhere in there, mud everywhere in here, mud everywhere and everywhere. The toilets are all leaking now. Some light in here. So that. Mm. Bird's room, all the possessions down here are wrecked. All these were all waterlogged now, and it's all wrecked. Carpet's all getting replaced. I'm stepping on squishy carpet right now. So that's all done. The bird is living next door. You can get another view of in there. That was a white rug, but it's all silt now. Um, they've had to knock out a whole bunch of doors and stuff. You know, I had to rip out the frame to allow it to drain some more. So this was the driest place at the time. So they put everything that the fire department moved things there. The insurance guys are here right now, which is why it's a little bit difficult to get around. You can see we're trying to take some possessions out. The whole area here is damaged. Things are starting to buckle. You can see the drains flooded upwards. Our stuff has been flooded down the, the whole street down there. You know, all of these walls are now buckling all the retaining walls are buckling you know bricks are missing it's all kinds of stuff this whole thing is starting to crack and crumble now that's massive work and those are structural retaining walls so they have to rip out the, the threshold here See here, we can't go into the master bath, which got the master bedroom, which got the worst of it because the insurance guys are in there. This is all wrecked, all the cabinetry is wrecked. Here's Jen and the baby. All these rooms, all these, you know, you'll find there were boxes of just old documents on the ground. They're all water damaged, all sorts of photos are water damaged, just stuff everywhere is damaged. My old room, all my furniture's gone. We've been going through bags of stuff that can be... All of this is wet, but there's some plastic stuff in there that we wanted Lucas to have access to. So we're salvaging what we can. Um, but, you know, that's all pretty wrecked. Uh, Got to get the wood toys and stuff. Meg's room got destroyed. It was bad in here. So, you know, you can see they've already ripped up all the carpet and everything. I want to get into the master bedroom, but... I don't know if we can with everyone in there, all the insurance guys. Let's see. Hi. Hi. So how are we? Well, I'm usually testing and then you're going to get 
get together with you guys and we're gonna all talk. Yeah, he needs to do his thing right now. Let's see the wall here is all everything. This is where the wall was buckled. Right here is where the wall buckled. It was it was pouring out from under the wall there during this whole thing. Uh, Mom's closet. You can't see it because it's all black carpet in there, but it's just sogged. All the custom walls are going to have to be repainted, and they're taking out the drywall. Oh, look, there used to be tile here. They're taking out the drywall two feet up of the whole house, and so if they can't match the wallpaper, they will rip it out. That's your phone. Hey! There's Meg. She's continuing to recover things. Lucas's first major disaster, other than what's in his diaper. That's pretty much it. So there's something to see. I'm going to keep packing stuff up, but it's definitely an exciting couple of, couple of days.